So don't be fooled. These people really don't care about money, about your money or investments. Well, they do, but only because they are being paid to convince you to sell your shares. Be careful who you follow and listen to. I totally agree with this in the sense that all of you out there need to do what you want to do when it comes to your shares. Every investment that you and I make is our investment. If you want to hold, if you want to sell, do whatever you want to do. But one thing's for certain, be careful who you listen to. AMC today on CNBC. Gary Gensler said things like transparency helps our capital markets, lowers the cost of capital, raises return for investors. Sarah said, hedge funds say transparency is bad, discourages short selling. Gary Gensler then said, Congress mandated these rules for everyday investors. Remember the events around GameStop laughing in the background? No, seriously, we have a lot of transparency on the other side. Let's add the transparency on the short side. So this has been going around the community quite a bit, this most recent interview with Gary Gensler on CNBC. And comment down below your honest thoughts on it. And if or if not, do you think Gary Gensler is truly on the everyday investor side? This ape says we went from going bankrupt to becoming bigger than we ever imagined. We're now AMC Theater Distribution, and it's only the start. Who knows where this company will go with CEO Adam Aaron steering the ship and an army of retailers, an army indeed. And they say fundamentals don't matter, but we're seeing exactly in front of our eyes how strong the apes really are. This ape says, I know I'm late, but I finally watched The Big Short and I have two genuine questions about it. How would the housing crisis and AMC be tied together? I understood what happened in the movie, but I'm missing how it's going to affect AMC. They never mentioned stocks in the movie. This ape also said, why would they even make a movie like this explain exactly what happened? Also, there's going to be a dumb money movie. And for those of you that aren't really aware, this ape down below said answer to the question. ADR VIEs are the structures used to offshore mortgage-backed securities or MBSs. These were never closed out after 08 and were just moved off balance sheets. ABSs didn't get to blow up, but they are closed now. You can look at the offshore funds. And number two, because it's not exactly what happened in the movie. The movie doesn't talk about Lehman or the other big toots that were listing loans as profits on their balance sheets via the repo market. The repo market just hit the highest it's ever been, mind you. And if they lied to you about balance sheets then, you bet they're lying about Sol Benaya purchase now. Comment down below any other ways on how you think that the big short movie and what happened back then correlates with AMC as of now. This ape says, and people think synthetic shares don't exist. It says pressing F3 to locate stocks. For short selling earns, Goldman Sachs a $15 million fine. So it says Goldman Sachs was fined $15 million by the Securities and Exchange Commission for violating securities lending practices. According to the SEC, GS employees routinely process requests by customers to locate stock for short selling by hitting F3 button on their keyboard, which would trigger a fill from auto locate function based on the amount of start today inventory at major institutions. The SEC pointed out that the automated system had already redeemed inventory to be depleted based on local requests earlier that day. So these are the things that are going on. Just imagine what's happening right now. Unusual Whale says Citadel Securities had their first half trading revenue fall over 35% so far and profits were nearly down 60% in the first half of this year. So Citadel, along with many other funds, have had a really rough first half of the year due to a lot of shorting when the market decided to melt up. Make sure to check out all these other videos to catch up on all the latest AMC stock DD and information you need.